come stand over here. Sam, I put this one down. We save it for the end of the show. Sam, you have a very, very important job. You do all the stuff for our facing me. You have the job of throwing the very first torch of the show at me, okay? Sam, watch carefully. Hold it in the middle. We're going to do a little test. A little bit higher. Look where I hold it. Yeah, perfect. Sam, there's a good right way and a wrong way to throw the torch. This is the wrong way, okay? You throw the first torch at me like that. These two are going to come back, okay? So, no underhand, it's just going to be a straight throw. Straight, no spin, okay? We're going to do a test, okay? Test throw, no fire. If it works, we give her some encouragement because then I put my life in her hands. <laughs> Quick test throw, straight throw, push forward and release, okay? Right here. On the count of three, set. <laughs> <laughs> Not the best start. It's okay though. That was obviously my fault. Oh, no. so just kidding. All right, Sam, on the count of three. Sam, that's okay. On the count of three. Everybody on my count. Okay, uh, everybody, not just the kids and the drunk people. Everybody. Again. Start over. From the beginning. One, two, three. Let's do a little bit. That's the easy part. Straight right there. The fine portion. Hold that up nice and high above your head. We light up the third portion. Everybody, hold on. Clap. see the flame and not the handle. This is great. All right. Five torches. Nine years to learn. And judging by the reaction here, I should have learned something else. There's one. 
Alright. It's a little bit dark, I can only see the, the flames. So if this doesn't work the first time, I'm sorry. And when it doesn't work the first time, sometimes it goes forward. So I'm extra sorry. And there's one. After this, the big finale. First for five questions. What a stupid idea. using only my mouth, yeah. and then we do the grand finale. I don't know what you're expecting. <laughs> Alright. That rest of the kids, you wait your turn, and you get nothing. <laughs> Alright, come on over here. What's your name? Layla? Layla, can you stand right over here? Layla, we're going to put this right here, and you're going to stand facing it this way. One hand here, one hand here. All right, Lena, take a couple steps backwards towards me. A little bit more, yeah. And one more, one more. This guy here. What's your name? Gavin? Gavin, one hand here, one hand here, okay? Gavin, uh, up here. Yeah, perfect. Gavin, do you have a girlfriend? Layla, do you have a boyfriend? Yes, I okay. do. Uh, sorry, Gavin. It's not going to work out this time. I told you to wait in the car! Alright. The last torch goes right here. We're just about ready to... Very important. Until I tell you to run away, don't move, okay? Because as long as you... No, no, until I tell you to run away. So stay there until I say go. Don't say so. Ah! Okay. Go move, go move, no more moving. Okay. This goes in here like this. It's okay, guys. I, I got a small one, too. Okay, I like this up. I count to three, and you guys run away, okay? On the count of three, you're gonna let go and run away. But before you run away, just remember to let go. Alright? When that happens, everybody goes nuts. They cheer, they scream for you guys, louder than they did for me, being right after coming up here. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, before I do this last trick, the last part of my show, I just want to say thank you to all of you guys for showing up here, for sticking around, for watching my show. It's been a pleasure to perform for you guys. Give yourselves a big round of applause. You've been fantastic. Uh, I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible, but I just have to say one quick thing before I do the trick. Uh, my name is Yoshi. Uh, I'm from here in Ottawa. I've been juggling for 10 years. I put a lot of work. It's my passion. It's my job. Uh, for here, performing for you guys today, uh, I'm not paid by the festival or I'm not paid by the city or anybody else. You guys are my boss, so if you like the show, at the end of the show, come up, put something into my hat and say thank you for the show. Um, if you don't know how much to give or you're unsure, uh, if you buy a beer, a pint somewhere in the market, just as an example, cost you about a five or five bucks. I feel like 40 minutes live entertainment on the street for you guys is worth at least a beer, five dollars. Or a fancy coffee, fancy beverage, whatever of your choice. If you have ten dollars to go for a fancier beer or a fancier drink, uh, ten dollars would be amazing. Twenty dollars would be some just leave, walk away, come say thanks anyways. Uh, this is a show on the street, so it's accessible to everybody. Rich or poor, that's the great thing about doing your show here on the street. No matter how much you make or how much money you have, you can come see it, and you get to decide how much money you give me. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to say to a six-year-old heckling me. All right, guys. On the count of three, you let go and run away. One, two, three, go. Come on, everybody! All right. 
We put this up in the air like this. For this trick to work and for the balance not to fall, I have to balance it the whole time. That means I'm looking straight up and I don't see the juggling. I can't see the knives. It's like a six foot flaming blindfold on top of my head. Just a quick disclaimer. Sometimes I mess this up and for whatever reason it always falls in that direction. So just be careful a little bit. It doesn't happen very often, but it's always that way in my head. No, I'm just kidding guys, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. It's, it's always a different direction, I don't know where it's always different. Alright. The balance is up. As long as my narcolepsy doesn't kick in, we should be ready to go. Just have to fix this wedgie quickly. Alright. I put the knives together, and everybody claps once. Thank you, all seven of you.